Okay, today we're going to talk about non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs, or we can call them NASIDs. Uh, it's indi they are indicated to uh, relieve moderate to severe pain, especially that arise pain that arises from the visceral organs, or we can call them internal organs. Okay. Uh, example here we have brufin. Brufin it it's found in uh, in the form of effervescent granules, or in the form of tablets. Brufin is uh, it's considered to be an analgesic, anti-inflammatory, and antipyretic. Okay. So let's look at the cautions of uh, non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs. Uh, cautions, it should be used with patient, uh, special care in patients with impaired respiratory functions. And it should be avoided in cases of patients with obstructive pulmonary disease. Also, it should be avoided during uh, acute uh, attack of pulmonary asthma. Cautions uh, should be taken in case of also uh, in case of patients with hypotension, prostatic hypertrophy, disease of biliary tract, uh, uh, shock myasthenia gravis, inflammatory bowel disorder, convulsive disorders. So uh, here are some of the, um, the most common examples of nasids. Okay, we have cataflam, voltarine, brufin, ketofan. These these are some of the uh, and non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs that are found in the markets. Okay, uh, thank you for listening and goodbye for now.